a lady. Perhaps it's time to go home. The South doesn't seem to agree with you. I know the truth John Aaron died for. Do you, Lord Stark? When the King returns from his hunt, I'll tell him the truth. You must be gone by then. You and your children. I will not have that blood on my hands. Go as far away as you can, with as many men as you can. You should have taken the realm for yourself. Jamie told me about the day King's Landing fell. He was sitting in the Iron Throne and you made him give it up. All you needed to do was climb the steps yourself. Such a sad mistake. I've made many mistakes in my life. But that wasn't one of them. Oh, but it was. When you play the Game of Thrones, you win or you die. There is no middle ground. You promised Catelyn you would help me. The Queen has a dozen knights and a hundred men-at-arms. Enough to overwhelm what remains of my household guard. Sir Barristan, I believe no man here could ever question your honor. King Robert's seal, unbroken. Lord Eddard Stark is herein named protector of the realm, to rule as regent until the heir come of age. May I see that letter, Sir Barristan? Protector of the realm. Is this meant to be your shield, Lord Stark? A piece of paper. I did warn you not to trust me. You do me wrong, my lord. Your blood is the last thing I want. I don't know what you want. Cersei knows you as a man of honor. If you give her the peace she needs and promise to carry her secret to your grave, I believe she will allow you to take the black and live out your days on the wall. You think my life is some precious thing to me? That I would trade my honor for a few more years of what? Of war? Ned Stark was killed in Game of Thrones for a number of reasons. Firstly, he was too honorable and refused to play the Game of Thrones. Secondly, he knew too much and was a threat to those in power. Ned Stark was a man of honor and duty. He believed in doing what was right, even if it wasn't popular or expedient. This made him a good leader, but also put him at odds with many of the other characters in the series who were more concerned with power than principle. Ned's biggest weakness was expecting others to act with honor and he often made decisions based on what he thought was right, without considering the political ramifications. He made enemies of powerful people like Cersei Lannister, who eventually had him killed. Ned's death was a turning point in the series and profoundly impacted the course of the story. Without his leadership, the Starks were scattered and vulnerable. His death also allowed Cersei Lannister to consolidate her power. If you like the content make sure to subscribe, as we have more videos about the men of Star Wars, Lord of the Rings, The Wire and Game of Thrones. Be sure to check out our Patreon, also leave your comments on what men we should analyze next.